Welcome to another edition of Tech Radar Talks. I'm Mark Chaxfield and this is uh, James Peckham. Uh, today we're going to talk about flexible phones. There's a rumour out that the Samsung Galaxy S7 and the Samsung Galaxy Note 5 are going to have even curvier displays uh, like you've seen on the, on the 6 Edge. So James, what do you think of curvy displays? Uh, it's interesting, isn't it? It's, um, Samsung's really seems to be stepping up a notch by yeah, releasing yeah. this phone right here, the uh, S6 Edge and obviously the uh, Note Edge yep. last, last September. Yep. Um, yeah, going flexible is the next step though really, isn't it? When you think that this is, this is just a curved display, but going actual flex, going the full way of flexible is yeah. a completely different step. And it being the Note 5, we're expecting that in September. So it's not far away in that, if, no, that, if this room proves to be true. Exactly, and I saw, I saw the, uh, the Note uh, 4, or the, the Note Edge in yeah. September last year, and, uh, and I was really impressed when I saw the, obviously, yeah. the, the lip, the curved, the curved screen. It's the first time we've seen Samsung actually do that. Mm. But what, what I thought was, was really impressive was they actually used the lip, and um, they had apps that you could, uh, you, could, um, yeah. you could read your messages, you could, you could use it as a measuring yeah. device and that that's, sort of thing. So, that's kind of been the problem with this phone, because we've just put the review up on the site, yeah. and like, there's a load of those apps and those actual the actual functionality of it seems to have been dropped a bit. Yeah. So if Samsung's going to go down that route, they really need to step it up a gear. Which I thought was throw, strange. Yeah. yeah. Because uh, obviously if you've got a curved screen, you think that they'd actually try and add extra functionality. Yeah. But actually for that, it, it makes it look lovely and nice, but is there a real reason for, for having it on there? Exactly. And yeah, they really need to step that up a notch if they're going to start putting that into the actual, if it's going yeah. to, the, the room says S7, it may be an S7 Edge, yeah. but it, yeah but they could go the full route and just turn around and say, right, you're just gonna have a flexible screen. But this is the thing with Samsung at the moment, they are one of the only manufacturers other than LG that can do these curved screens. So they've yeah. got the, uh, the manufacturing process. Uh, the, there's talk that the, the yield of the, uh, of the screens will, will increase, which means we should be a lot better for them. Mm. And it also means that uh, they, can, they can knock them out a lot cheaper. Yeah, so we, we might start to see it on, um, that on, is the on other budget problem. handsets as well. Because this was 120 pounds extra compared, yeah. to the, compared to the S6. Yeah, exactly. So yeah, that price, jump is going to be a bit of a problem as well. Yeah, so it'll be really interesting to see what happens in the uh, the Note Edge 2, whatever, they, whatever they're going yeah. to call it, uh, if they're going to add the functionality but also uh, keep the curves or even even make more impressive curves for, for the actual handset. Yeah, that'd definitely. be really good. Obviously with the OLED screens, they can actually be even more flexible. We've seen that with the, uh, the LG G yeah. Flex. Um, where and do you think, too. yeah, where do you think that will actually go? Do you think we'll have um, a fully round, maybe for wearables, do you think it would be a proper bracelet where yeah. it would just be pure OLED? That's what we're all looking for to really isn't it that's that will be like the 10 year down the line kind of thing that we yeah. really want to see um obviously the g-flex 2 and everything at the moment is is just bendable in the slightest amount possible that you can sit on it kind of thing but yeah i think the future and it would be amazing to actually have ones that can turn into a you can actually have a smartphone yeah. wristwatch kind of thing yeah instead it'll, of it being a smart watch and what about a watch you can even just roll up and put in your pocket right? exactly so just, yeah. yeah yeah it'd be yeah. fantastic so let us know what you think in the comments below. Uh, do you think that Samsung are ahead of the curve when it comes to curved screens, or would you rather your phones be a little more straight edged?